Hello! Today, we're going to show you how to make your very own Ertle the Turtle! Ertle the Turtle! This is our Ertle the Turtle, and now we're going to show you how to make your very own. So in your special camp in a box, you should have gotten some model magic and a new set of colored markers. But if you have other colored markers that have green, that's great too. That's all you're going to need to make your Myrtle. So for Myrtle, Ertle. Myrtle. Whichever turtle you'd like. I'll do Myrtle. I'll do Ertle. Perfect. So first we're going to open our Model Magic. And it comes in white, which is great because our markers actually are the perfect um, tool to decorate our Model Magic. That's because right. it doesn't rub off or anything. So we're going to start off with our big white model magic and what's fun about this is you can make it any shape that you want. So if you want to make a big turtle or a couple of little turtles, that's great too. So to start off, I'm going to try to start with my turtle's head. And I'm going to start by breaking mine into one big ball and then one little ball. And I'm going to start with the big one. This is going to be um, Myrtle's shell. All right, so I have my head. I'm gonna try to make it kind of a ball just like my friend Paige made. And I'm just gonna put it to the side because I think I wanna work on my shell first. So I'm gonna make sure I have enough to make the four legs and the tail before I work on the shell. So I think these two pieces are great to turn into two little legs. So I'm just gonna keep molding it in my hand until I find a shape that works for me for its foot. And you can also use um, other tools as well like butter knives and um, maybe popsicle sticks or popsicle anything sticks. that you might have at So home. you can draw lines, you can draw shapes in the model magic and when it dries it'll stay exactly the way that it is. So I have my shell, I just used my fingers and just kind of made little indents around the shell. But I'm happy with how that looks. And I'm still working on my little toes. My little turtle mm. toes. So I think I have the outline here. Let's see. And then I'm gonna also work on a little tail. Now I've forgotten that turtles had tails, but my friend reminded me that they do have That's a nice great. little tail. It's just a little one. So I'm gonna make room for that at the back of his shell. Now I'm gonna work on. I think I might make my head a little bigger because this one has a bigger head. He does have a big he head. He does have a big head. So let me see how I can make his head a little bigger, a little friendlier. That. Alright. So now I think I'm gonna work on my shell, mm. just like you. So this is very difficult trying to make some octagons on here. What's an octagon? It's a shape with eight sides. Oh. Do turtles have those on their back? They do. They have octagons. They have hexagons. They have polygons. They have wow, lots I, of different shapes. I didn't know they had that many shapes on they their sure back. Sure do. All right, so I'm working on my turtle shell now, and I'm going to use my fingers to push out the sides to make the shapes that Paige was talking about, only with my fingers, like that. So I'm going to attach his tail really fast. And now, I think I'm ready to attach his feet, too. Oh Paige God. is coloring it by piece, but I think I'm gonna color it all at once. So whatever works for you is just fine. I think that's good for my assembly. And now I'm gonna start decorating. Yay! Yay! All right, so. so I've made my shapes on top of the shell and now I'm just coloring them in. I used a dark color to make the shapes and I'm coloring it in with a lighter green. So I'm going to do the opposite. I'm going to start, so. I'm going to start with my light color and then I'm going to go over it once I finish coloring it in with the dark color. We're making our turtles green because we remembered that that's usually the color turtles are, but if you wanted to make a painted turtle, mm -hmm. you could add a whole bunch of different colors, or maybe even a rainbow turtle, okay. or a pink turtle, or a blue turtle. Any turtle color is fine with us. Any kind that you would like. Hmm. Do you know any fun facts about turtles? I don't. I don't know much about turtles. Hmm. 
I know that there's a whole different bunch of types of turtles, but that our friends are snapping turtles. That's right. Which means they are snapping turtles. We don't want to get too close to them because they'll bite your toes. They might get a little scared and nibble on your toes, but they're very friendly otherwise. And usually that just means it's because they're scared and they want to protect themselves from danger. Or they think your toes are a hot dog. No way. Sure. They think your toes are a hot dog. That's yeah. so silly. <laughs> Hmm. Right, I, I don't know. Let me see. Do you think this is the color of a turtle? Oh yeah. Yeah? Okay, oh, sure. good. Now I'm going to start on his little leggies. Alright, so I'm satisfied with that. Now I'm going to start with the head and I still have the small piece. So I'm going to break this into, I guess in half. And one of those pieces is going to be the head. Like this. And then I'm going to break the other piece into four smaller pieces. Okay. This will be the legs. Oh, I need a tail. Uh, don't forget your don't tail. Don't forget your tail. We keep forgetting about our tail. I wonder if the turtle uses his tail to help him swim around. Oh, I'm sure he does. I can imagine. See which ball is the biggest, and I'll take that with my tail. This, Maybe his. I'm gonna squash one end so they're like little raindrops, little cone, and I'm gonna use this. I'm gonna get started on my turtle eyes. Now, I haven't really been up close and personal with a turtle in a while, so I sort of forget exactly what the eyes look like, but. I have seen a lot of silly cartoon turtles before, and I think they always have some silly little eyes, kind of like sure that. Do. So I'm going to make my eyes look just like that, and I want them to be very happy, so I'm going to add a little smile. Of course. There you go. He's smiling. He's smiling because he's about to go swimming, and he's happy. We love swimming. I love swimming, just like the turtles. No, I wonder if our friends here have ever gone swimming in a pond or a lake or been near a pond in a lake where there's been turtles. Ooh. I bet some of them have. I bet some of them have. We sure did yesterday. If you find a turtle and do you make an turtle based off your turtle, send us a photo. We'd love to see it. All right, I'm almost done with my face. And then I'm going to go back in to make sure I didn't miss anything. Because hmm. we were, oh, my tail! See, good thing I checked. Good thing you checked. Good thing I checked. I'm gonna make my um, Miss Myrtle's tail blue. Oh, that's silly. Why not? Why not? Okay. All right, I love my turtle. I can't wait to have my turtle and I'm gonna save him so when it's winter time, I can look at him and it can remind me of when it was summertime. Oh, that's a great idea. I love and that I did idea. some fun camp activities. Sure did. I hope our friends at home like making turtles as much as we did. Oh my goodness, I love my little turtle. Me too. All right, time to decorate his tail. And then I'm almost done. Looks like you're almost done too. I am. I'm gonna give him like little rosy cheeks. Oh, good idea. And if you have a sibling or anyone that's making a turtle with you and you only got one pack of Model Magic, Paige and I actually worked together to make this we turtle. Did work so together. we split up the different parts. So it's also really fun to make a turtle with your friend or your family or your mom or your dad or whoever takes care of you. You nice. can all work together to make a turtle. I think I'm done. <gasps> You're done? I think, I think so. I'm almost done too. Would you guys like to see our turtles? Here they are. Here they are. Our finished Myrtle and Ertle turtles. Hooray! Yay! Great job! Thanks! Thanks.